That's right, new key card location. I cannot believe it either. I'm gonna be honest, but this is gonna be a video showcasing you where to get the new key card, how you do it. It's very intricate, it's very complicated. And I wanna make this video as quick as possible and get it up as quick as possible because I know other creators are still trying to figure out this mystery alongside all of us. And I wanna get all this information to people so we can get to the next chapter of these secrets because guess what? It gets even more intense. There's one secret after another and another, and it just keeps on going, and it's honestly nutty, dude. There's so many, and it just keeps unfolding. There's buttons everywhere. There's so much more that we haven't even been able to touch on, but if you want the full rundown, you want to know every secret that we found so far, how to do it, when to do it, everything about the portals, everything, be sure to go watch our live stream. We did another one uh, recently, and that had and covered a lot. So let's go ahead and hop on our bike here, and I do want to point out some very valuable things that might help you in your journey of finding out the secret. So obviously, all this has to do with the agency bunker a lot. I mean, dude, it gets kind of crazy. Mr. Brookhaven, the agency, everything in, in between, but we're going to be activating this little button here. Now, of course, we can open that. We know, but... We're going to be activating this little button here and getting a key card access. It's pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, this uh, there's a button under this. I mean, dude, it, see, can you press that? No. But um, there's a button underneath there. There's some paper down here, too. I mean, of course, there's a lot to do. And I just recently started and got into this lobby, so... We're going to see how much we really can do and where we can get all this kind of going and flowing. So, um, basically, guys, this new key card location is at the Scarecrow. You guys know the newly Scarecrow or, or the newly added Scarecrow that was near the bank, right? That's where you're going to get the new key card. Now, uh, you're going to need a shovel for this. Yeah, you got to do some digging, believe it or not. So, you're going to need a shovel. You're going to come over here. Uh, I don't know if we can actually get it yet. There's so many intricate things that you have to do before getting something else unlocked. And, guys so many parts of the map like you have to do this to get a secret that unlocks this so you can do this and do that it is honestly a a, in a <laughs> it is too it, it, it's a lot so like you know like the secret message uh, that's up here regarding um the uh the secret message up here for example like it's not here unless you do something and then there's like a secret button over here it's not lit up right now because you have to do something else i mean but that activates TS level 1. See, guys, there's so much I got to tell you. Like, this is just crazy. But, um, all right. So, what's TS level 1? It's a form of time travel. It's like, it's it's crazy, guys. But, anyways, right here, you will see there's something broken off on the ground here. And this is going to be the spot that you want to dig at. But it's only going to work at a very specific time, early in the morning. So, we're going to try to manipulate time and see if we can make this happen. So, let's go to 6 a.m. And then let's get our shovel out, and then we're going to get ready to dig right here. Now, how do we know when it's okay to dig to be able to get the key card? The bird is going... There's a crow. You know, it's a scarecrow. Well, oddly enough, a crow appears at the certain time in the morning, usually 7, 8, 9, somewhere in there. The crow appears. It gives you, like, a little sound, and then that's when you know it's okay to start digging. And you can get, you guessed it, the new black key card, which is going to gain you more access and more clearance to the agency bunker. Now, dude, and, and we still haven't figured out exactly what the key card activates when we we do get it. Um, so it, it is very odd. We still haven't exactly figured out, okay, we get the key card, we activate it. Like, what is it activating? Is it allowing for something? Does it showcase the button? I don't know. We're still figuring all this out. We're still unraveling it as it happens slowly but surely, little by little here, there, and all around. So, uh, you know, I always thought it was weird. I was like, okay. Oh, I need to make sure I, I hear for this crow. Um, all right, so, um, yeah, I always knew. It, the Scarecrow got added, and it's like, why is the Scarecrow here? W what is it doing? Uh, that's kind of random, but uh, now we know. We It does have a purpose. All right, so it's 7 a.m. Hopefully, it doesn't have to be on a Tuesday, a Wednesday, or Thursday. There's the crow. You guys hear the crow? Okay. So, the crow is here. We heard... We're gonna keep digging. We're gonna keep digging. Okay, I don't see the crow, but I hear him. I know he's here. Okay, good. <clears throat> okay, so guys, you definitely heard the the scare uh, the crow there, right? Uh, for some reason, he's not here uh, yet. Maybe he appears at 8 or whatever, so we have to keep digging here. Now, guys, when I first found this, I was like, there's no way this is actually real. There's no way it actually works, right? Well, it does, and it, it, it's super unbelievable. So, all right, the crow was kind of making a little bit of noise here. We're still trying to dig a little bit around. Here's the crow again. I hear the crow again. Come on now. Come on down, crow. Drop the key card for us. Please. Drop it. Come on. <laughs> I'm just going to keep digging. I'm going to keep digging. Oh, that's all I can do. All right, so now we're getting to 8 a.m. We heard the crow a few times. We didn't happen to see the crow, 
But we did hear the crow a few times, and now we're still... Do we have to let the crow land? I don't know. Do we have to let the crow actually land on the on the platform? I don't think we do. But we I definitely hear him. He's around. So this is how intense some of these secrets are getting, guys. Just to give you guys an example of how difficult this could be to correctly pinpoint and even acknowledge what you got to do, right? So like I'm telling you guys, there's no manual to this either. It's just an incredibly difficult secret. Oh, there it is. There it is. There's the crow right there. And I got it. I got it. I got it, guys. I just got the key card right there. Woo -hoo -hoo! We did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Hold up. I want to I want to I want a photo with you, crow. Yeah, we got a photo of the crow. I want a, I want a better one. That's so amazing. Oh my god, dude. We did it. Yeah, he's he's weird looking, right? So, as you guys can tell, right at 9 a.m. it looked about what it was. So, right about at 9 a.m., boom, the crow actually landed. Uh, we can't scare him off or anything, but the crow actually landed, and then we had to do our shoveling like so. That is, that is so cool. That is so cool, guys. I mean, honestly. So, now we get this key card. Let's get it going. Let's get it going. Let's hop on our bike. Uh, my bike is speed is set to 45. This is pretty cool that we could do this without having to activate another secret. You know, I think that's a cool thing about it. So let's now go back to the agency bunker and get this working, get this key card functioning, right? So also, it, it, it's important, guys, to get your laptop because you will now get a message on your laptop as well. I don't know if we will right away, but let's try it. Um, the laptop will say um, you might have to connect the laptop through the arcs and everything to start getting the messages on the laptop. So it's probably not going to pop up right here. But yeah, if you want to start getting all the messages that you can get on your laptop, you got to connect your laptop first by connecting it to the arc and doing all that. And then you're going to start getting messages. And you will get a message when you pick up this key card and it will say um, use the key wisely. Um, you might see something that you don't want to see. And that's a message by Mr. Brookhaven left. Um, for you there, so that's what that's the that's the weird thing about the key. It's like we're we're starting to see things that we might not like to see if we use this key, right? So that's very suspicious. Also, guys, make sure you turn the lights off if you want to start receiving your messages uh, and your signals and stuff. Okay, so that's something to know. So let's go over here. Key card accepted. Done. Easy. All right, and that's how you get your key card accepted, guys. Um, so yeah, that, that, that hopefully helps you guys with that regard. Um, but yeah, so if you turn off this, it's usually going to say your signal array online. It's going to like, if you flip the light switch guys, it does change your message. Sometimes it can, um, turn your thing off. I don't know if I can activate the key card. No, I can't activate the key card when it's like that. So, um, yeah, so just do keep that in mind, but that's how you get the key card accepted into the thing, uh, and then get that message, which I'm not sure what it does. It looks like it actually gives us access to this, this button here. It looks like it gives us access to this button. Look at that, guys. So that actually is what that does. It opens up this button here. And now, obviously, you got to activate this button before you can press it. Um, just like you got to activate the button at the barn. But that's a whole other thing. There's more buttons as well, guys. They're scattered through all different parts and places, and they do different things. So that's a whole other video, honestly, about all the button locations and everything. I mean, like, Jesus, dude. This, this update is a lot more massive than I realized. And the more that time goes on, the more that I'm like... Okay, I covered the, the intense motel mystery earlier, right? No, there's more. There's the new key card. There's this and that and all of that. So keep your uh, keep your eyes peeled on the channel, guys. Make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you're uh, subscribing, liking the videos, everything of Relating Sword. We live stream. We go over all this on the live stream. If you guys uh, just want to sit through all that, you can. But um, this is more of a condensed version to kind of to go to one place where you need to be to get what you need to be. So that's how you do it. How to get the new key card. It's available, dude. You can you can go there and get your new key card. Also, everybody's like, what about the pool? Yeah, guys, a lot of the secrets uh, people uh, we know of already, okay? We know of our I thought I covered a lot of the, the basic secrets in my first video I did on this update. You know, like the little secret passage here and all this stuff. You know, these are not really too agency-based. They're just kind of like little fun, easy secrets, I think. And we're working on that extreme secret. So, you know, when you sign into the game and it's like extreme secrets, we're working on those. So, um... I do got other videos that need to be out as uh, quick as possible. There's more notes that I haven't shown yet. Uh, there's a lot of stuff to do. There's also uh, more buttons, more buttons, dude. There's so many buttons. Oh, my God. Where do I even begin? Uh, but, yeah, we're going to be working on it, getting it out to you guys as quick as possible. Love you all. We'll see you all in the next one.